You know, boys, I was born in a boomer shack, not too far from the railroad track. The choo-choo rattled my window pane, and water done leaked in every time it rained. And if this is not a transformative healing experience tonight, I will slit my throat live on air. <laughs> All righty then. And I think we should just uh, the, have the healing experience of this old Jim Reeves tune. Move it up one, Dad. You want an A, did you? I want an A. Give me the pig, then. Get the pig up here, because she's an integral ah. part of the show. Pig's a girl? Yep, because the show is a teaching show. We teach by mimic. Let's see if it's a little low, okay? Making believe I'll spend a lifetime Loving you And making believe My plans for the future Will never come true Making believe What else can I do? I can't hold you close when you're not with me. You're somebody's love. You'll never be mine. Making me leave. I'll spend a lifetime loving you. Making believe he'll never be mine. Loving you and making believe. Making believe that you still love me. Making believe. What else can I do? <laughs> we're just the, we're just practicing new, that song. New ending. You, it's a new you one. sing. You say I never I made even words heard. up. Oh, did you? Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I was gonna say I never heard that. I was writing that. I was writing. <laughs> <laughs> well, make make sure you squeeze the pig because uh, you know it's part of the show. Uh, live from the Brawler Griffin Heart Brawler Room Studios It's a really big old time radio medicine show Three chords and the truth That's why I know it's going to be a healing transformative experience Because I don't want to die Okay <laughs> I'm getting ready to die Yeah I'm always getting ready to die as we all should be Yeah But it's just the loss of the this particular yeah. cantankerous body Yeah Remember, part of me is you. Whoa. Yeah, baby. Hey. Part of me is you. Yeah, and that brings this to mind. Dust off your Bible and redeem your poor soul. Have you ever heard that? Nope. And you know when I'm talking about Bible, you know what I'm talking about? What are you talking about? I'm talking about watching our shows. (laughs) (laughs) And I'm talking about going down to Patreon if you're Abby. And reading about that crap, because that's a secret of happiness and a meaning life. Right down there, Sounds we good. talk about it all the time, don't we? We sure do. This is behavioral science. This is cutting edge. This is groundbreaking shit. There you go. Can't and go I wrong. Just, I'm publishing it real slow, because I don't want the bullshit. Nobody does. And on that note, I'd just like to give you this information to all those people that are clicking by. Yeah. You know, the short attention span, even though Warren Buffett and Bill Gates were sitting there and they wrote down the key word to success in life and neither of them knew what they wrote down. They both wrote down the same word, didn't they, Mom? They sure did. They wrote down focus. Focus. The opposite of what the brains are going now mm-hmm. with the 
smartphones and uh, everything. No good. No good. Ah, not good. <laughs> so my message is this, Ma. Yeah. Slow down and go deeper. Still waters run deep. Aretha Franklin told me that. <laughs> Aretha Franklin? <laughs> okay, now we're, it's all rippers tonight. What's up? Um, it was going to be Ghost in this House. Really? Ghost That's what in you this said. House? You said Ghost in this House. I think it's down here, isn't it? Yeah, I think so too. Oh my God. I said that was one of them. And then the other one was I Won't Let Go. Yeah, I know, but that was just a couple of, like, several. <laughs> okay, never mind. We'll go with it now. But you're going to have to remind me how it started. I don't pick up the mail. I don't pick up the mail. I don't answer the phone. I don't answer the door. I just as soon be alone. I don't keep this place up I just keep the lights down I don't live in these rooms I just rattle around I'm just a ghost in this house I'm just a shadow upon these walls Quietly as the mouse I haunt these halls I'm just a whisper of smoke I'm all slept two hearts on fire That once been out of control You took my body and soul I'm just a ghost in this house Just a ghost in this house I don't mind if it rains Hell, I don't care if it's clear I don't mind staying in Cause there's another ghost here She sits down in your chair Oh, she shines with your light And she lays down her head On your pillow at night I'm just a ghost in this house I'm just a shell of a man I was Living proof of the damage I break down I'm just a whisper of smoke I'm all left to hearts on fire That once been out of control You took my body and soul I'm just a ghost in this house Just a ghost in this house I'm just a ghost in this house. Yeah, what I was thinking about doing, we did a whole lineup of rippers, right? And see if I actually do slit my throat at the end because I'm so sad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Ladies and gentlemen. Well, you know what can be found. Step outside. Sitting here all alone. It's the door to your mind. She can come around. Cause there's an old black Cadillac please, limo. Please telephone, don't be cruel. Waiting. To a heart that's true. Just outside. Because we gotta go for a ride. Gotta take a ride. We're gonna take a ride. Gonna take a ride. I pass a honky tonk. I pass a honky tonk. And the county line. And the county line. Through the amber waves of green. Through those waves of green. And past the dairy cow. With their big brown eyes. To the old county line road. The country road. The old country road. Gonna take you home. And all the girlies toes are hanging out of the window. Somebody cries up because there's a great big tower. Oh, the, look at that heat tower. Station GHRT. Station GHRT. Station GHRT. Is there for you and me. Is there for you and me. Brought to you by Alice's Restaurant. You can get anything, anything you, want. you want. Down at Alice's Restaurant. Down at, 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 at Alice's Restaurant. We're going to pull in the old station, go in the front door, and see Betty Page at the front desk. 
Gonna give you your special tea and send you down here to the Griffin Heart uh, Brother Room Studios for the really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth, starring Molly Griffin and her little uh, puppy dog named Winnie the Pooh. And the Reverend Dr. Joe G2 coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual haystack in your mind where the show always starts in five minutes. And we don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, oh, chill out, and relax spin to the mellow sounds soul. of the singing DJ. Spin them on our souls, DJ. You know, I think maybe I want to scat, Mo. Yeah, you always nah. do. Oh, somebody told me what that word means. In the scat, like scoopity up, booty up, and bop, 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 That's scat. Yeah, brother. Um. Mhm. Knowing. To know. To know. Is a verb. It sure is. It has degrees. Yeah. So, in other words, when somebody's starving over there, mm-hmm. and you know about it, mm-hmm. you know about it. You know about it. But you don't know it. But you don't know it. <laughs> you don't know it. No. <laughs> it's degrees. Like, you, I know, but I don't know. You know? The degrees are exactly peculiar to the knower or knowee. Depending on what you want to call them. Yeah. Depending on what the legal document is. <laughs> <laughs> it's peculiar to that. Everybody is g- at their own. Uh, it's so individual, you can't believe it. Yeah. No means no. You can know too much. You sure can. I noticed that my daughters know that. Mm-hmm. They stop me right away when I'm telling them something that is going to I don't want to di- hear it. You know, it's going to keep me up at night. Not, that's <laughs> right. And that gets right to my point because you know what that's all about? What? Beauty sleep. <laughs> Sanity sleep. <laughs> that's right. You're keeping yourself in good shape because you don't want to be down at the plastic surgeon getting your resting <laughs> bee dealt with. The biggest, it's the biggest, biggest plastic surgery dollar value Bar none in North America, and then by a lot, so I think, by like women, five times as much as the second one, is dealing with resting bitch faces. So it's, they get it so that their plastic surgery to s- be smiling even when they're resting their face? You go find out about it because I'm not spending any more time with it. There's a Batman movie about that. Oh, the Joker, you mean? Yeah. Like Jack Nicholson? Yeah, and then he does this thing where it makes everybody have this creepy smile face. And that's what's happening to the world. That's just what I want to do going. You know, doctors have low empathy, right? Low sensitivity because it's all math and science to yeah. be a doctor. You don't yeah. need to be really feeling at all. I know Not they all, all they doctors. all get the, the third. I, I'll bet it's worse than third mm-hmm. leading cause of death. Mm. Heart, well, cancer, doctors. Well. You understand me? Now, listen, they get their bedside manner down because they won't get be getting no money if they don't. Got a bedside manner, mm-hmm. and I'm not knocking doctors. I've had good no, ones and I've had ones. bad I ones. Had a good one. I'm just talking truth here. Truth. I'm just talking truth. So sad. And that's just what I want to do: is get one of those guys with a knife cutting on my face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're not artists. What about you, Hank? You want to <laughs> get your arresting bitch face? Cut? He says he goes. He's got his uh. That's how I get rid of my <laughs> resting bitch face. <laughs> hey, if I'm resting and I'm looking bitchy, that's okay. Because if I'm resting, I don't want you coming near me. Yeah, resting but bitch face, it's a survival thing. Yeah, but you should m- maybe kind of just try to get one that goes like a little bit up. <laughs> <laughs> that's not very restful. <laughs> because it stays. Well, like I think if whole. women are worried about resting bitch face, guys should worry about you resting can, you bastard know what? Face. You know how you can deal with a resting bitch face? <laughs> Watch this show, get down and read the stuff down at Patreon, and get your shit together checklist together. Mm. Shit together checklist. Brain chemistry management. I'm the father of it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm the granddaddy perp of brain chemistry management. This is my resting face. Is it a resting bitch face? Mm. Not too much. A little bit, maybe. 
Maybe I, mean, right. I might be doing. There's <laughs> nothing you can do about it except get your resting oh. face. You'd be lying, you know, if you're like a, you know, you'd be lying. You put a different look on your face. Yeah. You'd be the walking lion person. <laughs> I'm resting. Do I look rested? <laughs> oh my God! Let's sing a song before I start bragging at you. You could just start walking around. Like before that. I start my bragging at you. All right. You want to sing uh, I Won't Let Go? You know what key it's in? No, we haven't sung it in a long time. This is a podcast, you know. You're supposed to have your shit together. I think it might be up in like a B or a C. Uh, Let's keep it low because I think I remember screaming. Like a storm. Here, I can probably get it. Hey, give me the pig. Where's the pig? It's always here. Well, it's no good to me over there. I like him perched in front of me. Because this is a teaching moment. You shouldn't have said anything. You see, when she went, like a storm, I can't get out of that key now. <laughs> I can get out of it. I'll show you how I'll get out of it. Like a storm. That's different. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like it low like that? Like a storm. No, because then you're going to have to go, I won't let go. It'll be too low. Well, let's try A sharp then. All right. Rascal Platts, right? Yeah. Wish you knew the writer. <laughs> like a storm. Cut. Cuts a path. Breaks your heart. Oh, it feels like that. You think you're lost. But you ain't lost. On your own, now you ain't alone. Yes, I will stand by you. I will help you through when you've done all you can do and you can't go. I will drive. I will fight your fight I'm gonna hold you tight I won't let go No, I won't let go It breaks my heart To see you cry I know it's dark This part of life Oh, it finds us all But we're too small To stop the rain Oh, but when it rains I will stand by I will help you through When you've done all you can do And you can't cope I will dry your eyes I will fight your fight I'm gonna hold you tight And I won't let you fall Don't be afraid to fall I'm right here to catch you Oh, I ain't gonna let you Down I won't let you down Oh, you're gonna make it Oh, I know you can make it Cause I will I will help you through When you've done all you can do And you can't go I will dry your eyes I will fight your fight I'm gonna hold you tight And I won't I 
is okay. I think I know why my forehead ah. <laughs> is getting so huge. Look. Huge. <laughs> huge forehead. Well, I can see it a little bit, actually. Dwight has one, too. Yeah. Worse than me. Is it because of the hat? No. It's because moss don't grow on a busy sidewalk. <laughs> <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> I think some people say street. I sort of favored sidewalk. I had to make a decision because the writers put down street. And I, they've been really busy. You see all the holy crow, a uh, whole crew of them. Okay. What? Oh, you! I lost you in that last song. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a podcast you can hear when she goes. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, this is a nice thing that I have for everybody. Listen to this. If and you're thick and dumb, you might be poor and sad. Watch this show and get more sensitive. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's straight out of the old country of western. Oh, it's not okay. really hurting anybody. Okay. It's not okay. like picking on it. Oh, she was so ugly. Uh, good, uh, you know. <laughs> yeah. I already said that, right? Yeah, you did. <laughs> Live on air, baby. Yes, sir, Barbarino. I told you the Irish. I'm trying to get you out of here. I'm trying oh, to get yeah, you okay. back. I told you that last, the last show that we should hire the Irish, and they're allowed to have a few Norwegians uh-huh. because that's what I am. <laughs> no, but I can put up a good argument for it. Mm. And last night... Only one day after the show that I said that, an Irishman took out the UFC whatever (laughs) with the biggest fight of the century. (laughs) Uh, Conor McGregor versus... Hey, let's make one of those pictures, Ma. Conor McGregor versus uh, Cowboy Saroon. And I don't want to pick on the WAPs. Yeah, my Conor McGregor. <laughs> I don't want to pick on the WAPs, Ma, because they are the highest IQ in the Western Europe, you know? Yeah, they <laughs> Western are. Europe's pretty good. In the Western Europe, they yeah. are the highest. They don't really pay that much attention to IQ because they know that the empathy in yeah. that part of it has so much to do with it. What do you want to look at as growth and development stats and shit like that? But anyway, I'm not getting into yeah. that. I'm not yeah, getting into that heavy stuff. I'm yeah. talking about how the Irishman took him out in 40 seconds. Well... He hit him with his shoulders and busted his nose, and the guy, Cerrone, didn't, he'd never, nobody had ever seen it before. <laughs> like, this dude is fighting because he's pumped his shoulders up yeah. really big to do it. <laughs> and he broke his nose and busted his face up and then kicked him right in the face. And <laughs> had a couple of punches out of the ground, it was all over. Nice. 40 seconds. It was all over. But I got to get in the debate because there's some people, because I, I got to admit, I had thoughts. I went, hmm. You know, because if you were dramatizing and making it, you know, like wrestling, mm-hmm. you'd kind of do that. You might do that. Mm-hmm. But I sort of don't believe it, but I do a little. Yeah. <laughs> but we're going to find out because Joe Rogan is on the YouTube and we're going to be debating it. <laughs> and he says, no way. And I don't think Joe, would you think Joe would get involved in something that would just completely blow his whole life? No. Because who's going to watch him anymore? interviewing all these heavy people and stuff if he's mm. phony yeah, because no, that's no, why no. He, that's him. why he's so big he's not yeah. phony he's yeah. like a guy he's like yeah. a dude yeah, yeah. he's, he's dude. got himself pumped up good too yeah yeah i did that when i was his age too i'm gonna try and do it i'm gonna try and bulk up a couple of years ago i'm gonna try and become a muscle woman what do you, you want to do that again I yeah did. baby i really liked it actually <laughs> 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 it, felt, it felt right <laughs> um 
I pity the poor bastards that get my daughters. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> okay, we gotta sing a song. We can't. Come on. A ripper. How about I Am Weary? Give you a little break. Oh, here, yeah, Dad. yeah, yeah. That's pretty and then, sad. And then after that, maybe She Thinks I Still Care. Sounds good. As low as we can go. Yeah. Do uh, <laughs> get in a C for I Am Weary. I'm pretty sure I need to do it in a C. Higher. Yeah. You're going higher? I think so. But you haven't been practicing. All right. <coughs> let's do it. Feeling pretty good. <laughs> okay. And, and if I go off a bit, it's because you never sing it. So I, yeah. you know, I'm supposed to be singing the harmony, right? This is a. This song actually was not. It was wrote in the 1960s. Oh, really? Believe that, eh? Oh. Sounds like the 1860s, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, sure it? does. But no, and it was about the guy that I think he. They, I know he's. They don't call him the father, but he did a lot for bluegrass. Mm. A lot for bluegrass. Yeah. And of course, who is it? The Whites? The, the, the Cox big, family. The Cox. Yeah, Two that's X. the old farmer looking dude that says, I got the papers on all of them. Because mm-hmm. <laughs> it's a family band. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Kiss me, mother, kiss your darling. Lay my head upon your breast. Throw your loving arms around me. I The light is swiftly fading. Brighter scenes they do now show. I am standing by the river. Angels wait to take me. Because I don't, I never. Well, that doesn't help me. (laughs) 
It does. Ah! <laughs> Shut up. That does actually, it, when I'm looking at you, it helps me. Yeah, and I've seen somebody. On, and the other thing is, I, I think I like to put my uh, things in my ear and stuff yeah, like that yeah. when I'm getting in real that's deep. Like, that's hey, like this is a teaching mm-hmm. moment. Mm-hmm. When you're getting in really deep on some funky harmonies. Yeah. You, you need you to do like things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a teaching moment, Ma. Yeah. You need to do things. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you did really good right up until the end. <laughs> we'll get it. We'll it's make a recording of it, and and uh, then you can do it perfect, like everybody else in the music business yeah. does, and lives on that forever. We're at time, but what was it we were going to sing? We're going to sing She, she Thinks I Still Care. We're going to sing one real happy song yeah. now, just to finish things off. Just a little door um, Jones. Yeah, and I won't say that or nothing because you, you stole the show with, the, with that weird moment. Here we go. <laughs> oh, and that's going to be yeah. way too hot. We want this baby G- down. G- 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 What's wrong? I'm pretty sure it's G-sharp. But it is, but it's too high. Okay, okay. Just because I asked a friend about her Just because I spoke her name somewhere Just because I sang her number by mistake today She thinks I still care Just because I want the same old places where the memory of her lingers everywhere Just because I ring her number by mistake today She thinks I still care So if she's happy thinking I still need Well, let that silly notion bring her cheer. Oh, how could she ever be so foolish? It's a trio. Oh, where would she get such an idea? Oh, just because I haunt the same old places. Where the memory of her lingers everywhere Just because I saw her and went all to pieces She thinks I still care She thinks I still care Quite a trio going on there. Uh, 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 what's a uh, Hank has been in the uh, Hank and Jimmy Joe have been in the damn uh, stuff again. I can see it on their faces. They let the dog loose too early, and they're just basically screwing the whole show up. But you can't wreck this show, and I do not have to slit my throat because <laughs> if this was not a transformative experience to you it is because you're too sick and dumb <laughs> and you need to watch more shows <coughs> and we'll tell you about the secret to happiness and the fact that your mind wants to evolve we all want to evolve and if we cooperate with ourselves everything is going to get better sounds good now let's go shopping all right how much is that doggy in the wee 
Hindu. Oh, 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 the one with the waggly tail. I said the waggly tail. I said how much is that doggy in the window? Oh, oh, I do hope that doggy's for sale. I was thinking about you seeing me in the in the in the reflection. Uh-huh. I bet it's pretty funny. It was. It was terrifying. Uh, Cause if she is, we're gonna go get Roger Miller and go to walking in the sunshine, sing a little sunshine song. Bobby oo, Bobby oo, boo boo. You got to put a smile upon your face. If there's nothing wrong, Bobby oo, Bobby oo, boo. You got to think about a good time. Had a long time ago, sing my beginning about worries and woes. Walking in the sunshine, sing a little sunshine song. All you all go. Walking in the sunshine and sing a little sunshine song. The sexy price of knowing. Knowing. <laughs> Did we say that at the beginning? We talked about We're it. We're supposed yeah. to say yeah. it throughout. Yeah. It's a key word. <laughs> oh, well, Jesus H. What do you think? Is that pretty good? You know, at the beginning of the show, I said I was born in a boomer shack, not too far from the railroad track. Next time, I'm going to sing it. I was born in a boomer shack, not too far from the railroad track. Choo-choo, rattle my window pane. Water done leaked in every time it rained. That's a Roger Miller. <laughs> now, keep the cards and letters coming in and get down there. Get down and watch some shows and get on down to Patreon. You know, if you got no money, forget about it. Don't put no money. You don't have to put no money. You can learn all about how to be happy because this is the happiness place on earth so keep some cards and letters coming in we'll see you in the plenty papers and you have yourselves a good old dolce vito and down in paris and france and russia and china and japan whole works here yugoslavia dolce vitos